And we are back with some more Sitio de Belgrade or something. Siege of Belgrade. So, um, it's been a while since I've done this. As I have been preoccupied with Battle of Africa and some other stuff. But it is all good in the proverbial hood. Uh, except for the bit where I uh, don't really remember uh, what I did wrong. <laughs> I, knew I, did so I know I did something wrong. Because we got wrecked. Wait, do I have my eco upgrades research? I didn't even realize that. Or did I just do that without paying attention? Either I just did that completely instinctively, or they gave you the upgrades for free. So yeah, I played up until the point where we took... we got to Belgrade. And we're going to play a lot more uh, cautiously this time. Oops. What, what, did, what did I just say? You also stationed some troops there, in case you did not see. I die with honor. Okay, Constable Richemont. Ooh. So yeah, we're not going to focus so much on getting Imperial Age quickly. And much more on... Uh, units. Well, I still have a decent population, nominally. Just a couple fishing ships. Trapped fire ship. But yeah, uh, cav archers, knights, Possibly Magyar Hussars if I need them. Going to be the way to go. And I have to destroy the camps. Um, thinking. How well defended are these camps? I wonder. I only have 27 villagers, which is not great. Well, plus some fishing ships. Oh, there is some stone over here. Oh. Uh. Leave these guys over here. Why did they not give me the mining camp? I feel like that was a mistake. Why would I not be given that mining camp? Where did I get that Huskarl? That's a fair amount of Janissaries. 
Oh, don't tell me. Ugh. Sorry, Mihali. Okay, I can't really take that on just yet. Oh. Well, we tried to assault two camps simultaneously and uh, did not pay off. Oh yeah, Crusaders. I forgot about the Crusaders. Complete, completely unrelated to this scenario, why can we not get rid of the 90 kilogram over 300 meter meme stat thing? Like, you know, it's fun and stuff, but I want to be able to see what tech... Well, rather, I want to see if Siege Engineers has been researched. Or at least, I want to be able to see if Siege Engineers has been researched, um, or if Tatars are involved, uh, Timurid Siegecraft. Because you can't actually tell right now. Oh yeah, maybe I should go for Magyar Hussars instead of Knights. I probably said this last time, but uh, I don't remember. Whoa, that monk was moonwalking for a second. As it happens, uh, cities... Do not make for good air... Wait, mercenary. By clicking on the stable. What stable? This stable? Let's see what they're giving me. Ah! Not the rams! Plus one, plus one. Four knights for 200 gold. I mean, that's... I guess that's good. It's not much, but it's only 200 gold. Oh, I didn't even realize that was a forage bush. Lol. Uh oh. There's no room. Ah! Where are those blasted reinforced small? Okay, well, let's get them. A wise choice. Okay, Mongol slash cumin mercenaries from Barbarossa 1. Yeah, we still don't have the greatest pop limit ever. I don't know why I keep on checking there for farm space. They're, 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 it's not getting any more farm space anytime soon. At least these guys will clean up the bombard cannons easily. Well, fairly easily. castle up over there on that hill guess it's gonna mill over here lol wait what oh oh these docks are mine wait I'm like why can't I get fast fire ship 
Ragnar's good fast fire ship. Oh, we're not in Imperial Age. Duh. Oh yeah, should very much trebuchet over. Nothing else. These are my transport ships. I hope they ignore those villagers building the castle, otherwise I'm gonna have to go give Doubt a call. No, leave him alone! Oh, at least they destroyed that mining camp so I can build one. Oh, crap. Maybe I do need to give Doubt a call. Where's my army? Oh no. It is a doubt castle, isn't it? I thought I sent these guys down this way. Well, there went that castle. Oh, come on. Where is there more stone? Kinda hard to tell. There's a tile of stone. I'll take it. Okay. Tribute has arrived. Our golden extra town center over here, so we should focus on this TC, or not TC, uh, this Ottoman camp first. At least we're somewhat stabilizing. Oh, there's way more stone over there, sick. I guess I have masonry altar research too, unless again I just instinctively grabbed that because of my deep affection for masonry. 
But hopefully as I clear up these camps, um, it's going to get easier and easier. At least that's the idea. Oh! Kinda want this tribe alive. Wait, I never got ballistics. I never got ballistics. I'm a dum dum. Okay, castle here, take two! Imperial Age, take one. Sorry, dude. I, uh, do not have time for your supply thingy. It's time for the Witch Ottoman base. Oh, whoops. I thought something looked weird. <laughs> oh, is this base... Oh, no, this town's actually still still hanging out. Awesome, we're actually getting to the camp. Just need to take down this guard tower. Yeah, now we're getting stuck. Okay, let's get over here. Probably need to make another transport ship. Get that. Get those guys. Oh yeah, I guess Free Blast Furnace is helping us out a little bit. There's more gold there. 
A little high in wood, a little low on food. Okay, we got one camp. Awesome. Hopefully this leaves up our attacks from the south. Is that a lot of stone? That is a lot of stone. Yeah, Magyar Hussar is definitely going to be a good option. It's not like we have no gold, but we are fairly limited. Try and gather that stone if possible. Let's go for this camp now. Actually, that camp might be the big one. Archer upgrades. Oh, whoops. Keep patrolling in. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to mine that stone yet, am I? Let's see what's over here. Like, we're only utilizing a very small amount of the map. We slowly but steadily whittle down these defenses. I have no stone. I mean, we're getting there, we're getting there. I want to make more villagers, but I really don't have the population headroom I would want. Oh, wait, there's more gold that way. Nice. And there's more gold over here! Let's get a treb. Can even grab siege engineers, since we have plenty of resources for it. Oh! Things that recurve bow and screw it. I'm gonna get more villagers until I run out of pop. So we're gonna have a pretty high turnover rate, as in they keep dying. Rip Serbian village. We hardly knew ye. Let's 
Still, though, her position could be far worse. What's attacking me? Oh, that's the first time they're sending Trebs my way. Still, though, we have the power of Magyar Cav Archers, full upgrades now, and those are pretty sick. Magyar Hussars, too, are going to be really good. Magyar Hussars are kind of a weird unit because they're super good in 1v1s once gold runs low, but you don't really ever make them for team games just because the value of a Magyar Hussar is still way less than that of a Paladin. So you just, you know, make Paladins or Cav Archers. Because you uh, theoretically have trade and don't have to worry about gold. And if you do have to worry about gold, then you have way bigger problems. <laughs> Anywho, I do not know uh, if we win the scenario once we get rid of the Ottoman camps. I have to imagine that there's more, just because we've only used around half the map so far. Troops going. I'll get fast fire ship. Only one more camp. Yeah, I mean, there's still uh, Ottoman troops coming from the, the east, so I have to imagine that we're going to go have to take out wherever they're coming from. Yeah, these guys can be so crazy cost-efficient. Magyars might even have the best late game for 1v1s. Between uh, very uh, low turnover cav archers with the extra range and attack, and Magyar Hussars and cheap Hussars even, fully upgraded skirmishers. Halbs, the, their Halbs are kind of bad, but everything else is so good. Just kind of sucks against camel sibs. Well, the power of uh, all these guys is gonna take them down before the trebs even arrive. The city is saved. Wait, is that really it? Oh, I guess that's it. I thought there would be more. We only used like half the map. There's a lot of just wilderness on this map, I guess. One tile of gold here. Yeah, there's there's so much map. And this is, like the actual stuff that happens is really only a small percentage of the, the map. So are these just, is this just like a normal base? Yeah, these guys just have a normal, normal base. Looks like they are just a player like you and just are gathering resources and there are three pieces of palisade wall over there, okay. Yeah, so it's, it's not infinite unit spam by the looks of things. I don't know where they're getting gold from, but considering I see empty mining camps, I have to imagine they're getting it somewhere. 
Oh, and there was another town over here. Yeah, we never even visited that town. Huh. It was a good scenario, though. I, I enjoyed it. It's, it was definitely challenging. But it wasn't like, oh no, I'm, I'm so miserable, there's nothing I can do. You just have to give it another go and readjust your game plan a little bit. Um, yeah. So I guess there isn't an outro either. Nice KD there at the end. I don't know what the Cyan Ottomans were. I guess those were the guys that were just spawned in. But then I don't know who the orange ones were either. I don't know. Serbian village at least helped us out a little bit. Looks like orange tributed yellow. Oh, there's another scenario. I thought it was just the one. Well, first we have the Siege of Belgrade, and then next up, next time, we'll have El Asedio a Belgrado. Actually, wait a minute. Is this just the Spanish version? Yeah, this is just the Spanish version. Where you are having different colors? Yeah, I don't have Alt-G on. Because that would look like that. I don't know why they have different colors. So yeah, no, it is just the one scenario. Uh, this is just the Spanish version. Anyway, that will be it for this one, guys. Uh, next time won't be another scenario, but it will be uh, another custom campaign that I will do and stuff. Thank you all for watching, and see you next time.